Ahoy! Doom Eternal just came out, and uh, we're going to do a Let's Play series. Uh, starting off from, this is the first thing you'll see uh, when you get into Doom. Uh, says Master Level Login Reward. Just for logging in during our launch month, you have received the Arc Complex Remix Master Level. This Master Level features new and more challenging combat scenarios that will put your skills to the test. Well, that's good, because uh, I haven't flexed my FPS muscles in a while. <laughs> Arc Survival Evolved can only do so much uh, for that. Uh, so this is the menu that you're greeted with. Havoc, Eternal Slayer. Uh, let's check out uh, some of the settings, see what we're getting into here. In-game tips. Usually I, uh, I just kind of ignore those, but for... Uh, Doom Eternal, I think I'll pay some attention to that, at least for the first playthrough. Auto switch weapon weapon empty, I don't think so. I'll leave that on. User interface. Okay, yeah, so there's a lot of uh, stuff to go through on here. I, uh, these first live streams are always kind of uh, sketch because uh, you're not certain as to the settings and what's going to work for the live stream and what's not. So hopefully in chat, let me know if <laughs> notice me. What's up, Ruger Tucker? You're noticed. <laughs> uh, does the video and audio sound good to you? This is what's awesome about having you guys in here. You can tell me if I'm screwing up or not. Okay, so these are the default settings for my hardware. And not everything's on ultra. Okay, where is motion blur? I want to shut that off. I'm not a huge motion blur fan. Right there. I don't know, maybe we'll just put on medium. That way things don't look too plasticky. Hello, notice me please, Ruger Tucker. I'm the only one, yes. Okay, uh, Ruger Tucker says that the audio and video looks good. Uh, sorry for the late response. Uh, there's some latency in between what I'm doing and what I see in chat. All right, sick, man. Thank you. All right, let's uh, apply changes. F is in Foxtrot. Let's get out of here. Customize. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear this music in the background, but it's pretty sick. Mick Gordon. Doesn't screw around. Okay, so you unlock skins and stuff as you go through. I don't really have anything unlocked yet. I won't mess around with this. Let's get into the game, huh? Let's do it. Uh, for my first playthrough, I think I might do Ultra Violence, and then after that, maybe I'll skip Nightmare, go to Ultra Nightmare. Hopefully, I don't get humiliated. <laughs> Ruger Tucker, this is uh, Doom Eternal. It uh, just came out literally uh, ten minutes ago. Just got done uninstalling the package on Steam. And then went straight into this. Alright, I'll shut up so we can watch this. Against all the evil that hell can conjure. All the wickedness that mankind can produce. We will send unto them only you. Rip and tear until it is done.
Sounds like the beginning to a fatty D and B track. We must pray now, pray. Pray that he is watching. Please, anyone, if you can hear me, if you're out there. Attempting to acquire the Hell Priest signal. The Hell Priest signal. Nearly <laughs> 60% of our planet has been consumed by the invaders. Oh, you hear that bass line? Ah. Old school. Bethesda Sopolis, get the fuck out of here. The target is marked, but the signal will not hold for long. For it is he that they fear, not man. For his armies, they fear the mark of the beast. Ideas from the deep. So far, I think John Carmack would be uh, would be a fan. It's a pretty badass intro. Pump it. <laughs> Sounds like a devil priest. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's get some... Uh... Alright, forgive me if I suck. I haven't uh, played a first person shooter in a while. Hey, Ruger Tucker, uh, I usually use pretty high sensitivity, so if you could let me know, like, if you see, like, bit rate, like, if it looks like shit, please let me know and I'll, uh, adjust some of my OBS settings. Okay, so for these, I'm actually going to, usually I just skip through these really fast, uh, but I'll read through them and I'll give you kind of the down and dirty, so if you're going to play the game, you know what, what this is about. So, when you damage a demon enough, it becomes staggered and it begins to flash. When close, press E as an echo, or mouse 4 to glory kill it. Glory killing always spawns health drops. The less health you have, the more health it drops. The demons spawn. Okay. So... Chainsaw right away? Wow. Press C as in Charlie to instantly chainsaw demons and refill your ammo. The chainsaw requires fuel. Gas container pickups refuel the chainsaw. One fuel pip slowly refuels over time. Okay. So, E to glory kill, C to chainsaw. What are you guys saying? It still looks good on PS4. Yes, I'll play it. Nice. Press space to jump into the air, press space again while in the air to double jump. Double jumps are awesome. Some traversals require double jumping. Okay. Mario Cities. Alright, I'm OCD with uh, checking every corner. <laughs> Alright, so this is the weapon mod selection screen. Interact with a mod bot and then unlock a mod for an available weapon like Doom 2016. Use mods to expand each weapon's gameplay behavior. Okay. Full auto. Hold mouse 2 to transform the combat shotgun into a fully automatic weapon. Or a grenade launcher. Ah. Uh, 
I uh, know. I saw a live stream in there where they had the grenade launcher, so we'll go with the uh, fully automatic here. To activate a weapon mod, press or hold mouse 2, and then press mouse 1 to fire. Read each mod's description in the dossier to learn more. Search the environment to locate mod bots and expand your weapon's capabilities. Okay, I wonder if M opens the map. No? Uh, okay. Whoa! Snuck up fast! Oh, they can hit each other? <laughs> oh! Oh, out of fuel! Okay. Wow! Get my ass kicked! Yeah, it's gonna take me a little bit uh, to get the uh, flow down, I think. Out of gas again? Oh! Yeah, it'll be nice once I uh, get my flow down here. something about that. What are you saying in chat? Full auto shotgun would be crazy. <laughs> yeah, it would. Uh, hopefully that wasn't a terrible decision because I think ammunition is going to be kind of a pain in the ass in this game. Yeah, so I have no idea like what the pickups look like or anything really right now. We just saw the gas container. Okay, those things explode. That's good to know. See on the compass uh, towards the top of the screen as like a point of interest marker there. That's pretty cool. All right. Oh, I came from here, didn't I? <laughs> Hopefully, uh, hopefully we get a map here soon. Because I think the maps actually even show kind of where the hidden items are and stuff. Hell barges. Uh, just some lore. Yes! That's what I like. There are two hell priests remaining. Okay. Ah.
Hmm. All right. Well, I guess we'll unlock that. Press F to swap weapon mods. You can swap weapon mods during combat to fit the current situation. Alright, so that's... The objective marker shows you where your current objective is. It's present on the compass and the auto map. Press left alt to show the objective in the world. Okay. So, oops. Oh, guys, it just kind of makes it uh, blink like that, I guess, when you hit left alt. Okay, well, I suppose I could have shot one of those explosive barrels. Alright. Oh! Yeah, so as far as the controls go so far... Oh, what's up, Nightmare Maker? Yeah, no, um, it's awesome so far. Uh, the controls feel really good. Uh, I'm still kind of getting used to everything. Um, you know, timing out when to use E uh, to do the uh, glory kills. Uh, timing that out, and then C for the chainsaw, getting used to that, and monitoring the gasoline levels. Um, so, I mean, it's just a little bit to get used to. I know I suck right now. Okay, so it looks like I need to use that to jump across. Certain demons have weak points that can be shot for extra damage or even disable their abilities. Weak points flash red and damaged. The Arachnotron is a heavy range demon. Its turret is a weak point that can be destroyed. Disabling it is long range attacks. Okay. Base of jump maneuvers initiated. Oh. Right in the eyeball. Don't. <laughs> Man. 
Man, ammo is precious in this game. Man, this is a lot more challenging than I thought. Ultra violence indeed. God, I better get better, otherwise there's no way I'm gonna be able to <laughs> hold up as we go along here. Let's see what chat's saying. Ah. All right, let me take a swig break. Press Q or mouse 5 to quickly swap to your previous weapon. Hold Q or mouse 5 to activate uh, the weapon wheel and choose from all your weapons. Cool. Okay, so now we got two weapons, so <laughs> at least uh, we'll have some e extra ammo, hopefully. least more ammo. Finding an auto map station will reveal all undiscovered areas on the map. You can view the map in the map tab on the dossier. Okay, I was wondering about that. Your auto map can also reveal valuable items of the world as you explore a location. So check back regularly to see what you have uncovered. Okay. I missed that. And I'm OCD. Or maybe maybe that's on a different level. I don't think so. Whatever, we'll just push on now. I can get it later. Secrets. Kill what's ever over here. Don't! Kicked. Stuck. That was close. Oh my god.
Mick Gordon comes in with the baseline. <laughs> Nightmare Maker, when are you going to stream ARK again? Oh. I still got that uh, live server going. Uh, me and Blaze are kicking ass on it. Um, so really, I could live stream that whenever. I should probably be better about that. Oh, missed my chance. Wiggly. Yellow access. Yellow key card, I would imagine, huh? Alright, you know what? Uh, let's look at this real quick. So I've missed two things. Oh wait, it looks like... I don't know, it looks like maybe... I'm just going to go back up here real quick and see what that's about. Doesn't look like it's that far away. Looks like it's right up there. Yeah, I got interrupted by that uh, <laughs> spider brain. <laughs> What? How do you deal with that? Chainsaw? No. Okay, yeah, I don't know how to get past those bars. Maybe you can, uh... Ah! Extra life, that's so old school. <laughs> okay, let's move on. Let's almost die again. Yes, precious resources. What are you doing? Slayer can attach to pitted walls by pressing E or mouse 4. Find by pressing WASD, look around and jump to another location. Okay. What do we got down here? Low ammo, what else is new? <laughs> so this was that uh, yellow key card gate. Stop 
hitting me? <laughs> Flipping criminy. Oh! Uh. What? Take a look here. What is that thing? Whatever it is, I'm heading towards it. And since those are green, I'm guessing that means I picked those up. So I've only missed one thing, I think. That thing. Cheese it a little bit. Oh, forgot about those things. Oh, I wonder if I could. Ah, oh, dead. Oh, extra life. That's how that works. I'm wondering if those cannons won't actually. Oh, they locked me in here. I'm wondering if those cannons won't hurt it. Passive damage. So I have like nothing left right now. Okay, can't chainsaw it. Out of ammo, all I got is chainsaw, three health left. I'm screwed. Wow. Yeah, this turret is its weak point. Guys suck you guys. <laughs> Oh, space to continue. Yeah, I'm such a noob. Alright, what can I do differently this time? Not get hit by those cannons for one, I suppose. Yeah, I gotta play a little bit more safe, I think. Or maybe I should just go rushing in. Looking a lot better than uh, last time. The cleansing of Earth is a necessary step on the path to a brighter I thought I would brute force that time. Did not work. I don't know what I can do differently. I'll have to figure it out. I'm not used to sucking at video games. Maybe I was playing too defensively. Ooh. Come on. I need ammo. I need ammo real bad. Oh. 
Okay, what am I gonna do here? Should I try running past them? <laughs> Do I really suck this much? <laughs> what am I doing wrong? I figured I would just pick the ultraviolence setting because I thought it wouldn't be that big of a deal. Alright, let's play aggressively again. Which it's Doom, so I guess that makes sense. Alright, so I think, oh, I think this time I'm going to try just kind of running past them. God's sakes. Alright, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try running past, see if uh, we can't get into a more open area. Look at that. Press left control or mouse 3 to launch a grenade, which explodes after landing on the ground. The explosion damages and falters any demons hit by the blast, combo with other weapons. Spray grenade gradually recharges over time. Okay. Okay. That should come in handy. Really use some health. I don't like just running past enemies. I feel weird doing that. Kaka Demon is a pressure demon with a powerful close range bite. You can fire a sticky bomb and frag grenade into its mouth. It's staggered. It instantly staggers. Okay. Mm. <gasps> <laughs> I don't think I was supposed to do that. Oh, of course. Epic Gamer over here. You know, I had the same problem with Doom 2016 where it just felt kind of weird at first. It just kind of took some uh, getting used to. Let me take a look at the map here. I'm sure there's something in here. No? Okay. Well, that whole section uh, just seemed like the best thing was just to run by it, unfortunately. There we go. Hello. Okay. Alright, so it's got a super strong bite, so you don't want to get close to it. He stole my kill! What a dick! Oh! Got stuck on a ledge. Did I get him? I did. Oh, you gotta go finish him after that. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Alright. That was out of time for that.
Oh my god. He came out of nowhere. Oh, seriously? <laughs> I hate those things. Those things just rip through ya. Take that, you jackass. Run faster! Doom Slayer! Why are you so slow? Wow, they just keep on coming. How far back are you going to send me? Come on. I suck, you guys. <laughs> All right, Nightmare Maker. Take care, man. Thanks for stopping in. Seriously? <laughs> wow. Well, the benefit to playing on this level of difficulty is that you gotta learn quick. I wish my grenade were ready. There we go. <laughs> wow, that was a bloody mess. Don't. Oh my god. Dickhead. <laughs> well, that only really took me three tries. Lob. Well, I guess I can just continue. Alright, well.
Man, I think it's just gonna follow me, so I better just take care of it. Come on. <laughs> you don't get a whole lot of time to uh, glory kill those things. Okay. Cool. Moving on. Out of ammo for both my guns. So that's awesome. Secrets. Oh, there's something up there, but that's okay. There's something there, but that's okay. Looks like, uh, you go this way. I think. UIC would like to thank you for your support during this transition. Your suffering continues to inspire us. Suffering indeed. Well, there goes all my shotgun ammo. Those things can take some punches. What the F? <laughs> Tentacle? Why are there tentacles here? Get out of my way! Get out of my way! Oh. <laughs> That's my favorite one so far. <laughs> I don't like how those things can take so many uh, punches. Doom Slayer needs to get like some knuckles on him or something. Okay, this looks pretty clear. What does that mean? Jump down, I guess? Oh. Okay. Got 
Gotta get used to the, uh... Whoa! Shit! They can curve their flame balls? That's not very fair. Come on! Forget about the future. Grenade is up in about 10 seconds. There we go. My arch nemesis, no! Off, man. Oh, I'm done for. Ultra violence is right. Okay, we came in from that elevator shaft. Huh? Oh! How do we get in there? Probably from up top, huh? I'm gonna need it. <laughs> I would feel so much more badass on an easier difficulty. <laughs> I'm glad I'm playing out on Ultra Violence right off the bat, though, because, like, if you play a difficulty that's just a little bit above where you're at, it forces you to get better. Like, you don't get better by playing easy shit. So. I know I gotta go out there. Okay. Just wanted to do one more glance. Alright, I guess we'll just jump straight down, huh? What's that thing? Oh! <laughs> wow, okay. 
Okay. Jesus Christ. Sluggish ass shotgun. That'd be cool if there's a mod where you can shoot faster. Those things are going to be a death of me, man. Out of ammo. Completely. How do I get out of this mess? Grenade. Grenade, please. Alright, let's go for it. The thing doesn't miss! It hits you with, like, every shot. Those things are rough. Like, I know you're supposed to destroy the turret on it, but it takes all the ammo you have. this. What am I going to do different? I need more ammo, that's for sure. And I'm almost dead. Just like that. Go. <laughs> there it is. Oh, come on. What am I? You guys seeing this? <laughs> I absolutely hate the Arachnotron Arachnotrons. I'm gonna look for ammo here. Cause that's like my big problem, I just keep running out of ammo. Those arachnotrons take a bit. I'm not seeing any. F! Oh, 
Stop hurting me. Sometimes the best thing to do is just to run. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if you're supposed to be able to go over here. The Con okay. Reaper is nearby. She is inside that demonic citadel. I will mark her location on your HUD. Oh, hey, thanks, Sir Vega. It's awfully nice of you. Nice and cleared out the arachnotron. <laughs> uh. The gathering of hell priests is located just above your location. My scans indicate there is a lift at wow. the center of this facility. Yeah, this looks really cool. I feel like the Doom Slayer should be able to run faster. Awesome singing there, bro. Ah, boss fight? Fast travel allows you to teleport to predetermined points in the map. Use it to find additional items and complete optional encounters. Fast travel unlocks near the end of a mission. Access fast travel in the map tab in the dossier. Cool. I don't think we're done here yet. I feel like there's a boss here. Boss that's gonna eat up all my ammo. All right. Okay, so there is stuff in here. Oh. <laughs> right in front of me. And then there's one across this way. Come on, Demon Slayer, run! The Con Maker is present at this gathering, but when outside of her domain, she is by all accounts indestructible. Sounds perfect. Those must be the good guys. How can this be? No man can pass through the gate. It is. This stops nothing. The sacrament of this world to the great Khan Maker will be made, and the energy will be restored once again. As it is written, from the souls of the non-believers, you will not save them from their judgment. Don't. <laughs> I missed a bunch of stuff and I died a bunch of times. <laughs> Maybe I'll have to turn down the difficulty. Nah. It's nice being humbled every once in a while. the means 
means to locate the second Hell Priest. Your celestial locator is missing a component. Well, that sucks. Replacement. Oh. You mean I have to go get I it? The redesign of your equipment launcher. The flame belch is now ready for your approval. Oh, what's this? Press R to set enemies on fire, and they will drop armor shards. Kill them, and they'll drop the most armor. Flame belch demons in groups to maximize the number of shards dropped. Flame belch gradually recharges over time. Okay. Okay, so so far, um, we've got C for the chainsaw, E for the glory kills. Um, we've got control for the grenade. Now we've got R for the flame belch. So... It's going to take a little bit uh, to get fluent. That's like a really brief burst. Alright. So... Let's look at the map here. Okay. This is Sentinel Crystal Selection Screen. Use a Sentinel Crystal to permanently upgrade your health, armor, or ammo capacity. Yeah, I think I'll do ammo. Uh, You can select an upgrade to increase your... Yeah, 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 okay. Space. Okay, there we go. Um, resource drops get pulled in from much further away. Resource... Okay. Clean belts takes less time to cool down. So that's for health, that's for armor, that's for ammo, that's for armor. I'm gonna do the ammo one. Because most of the times that I've died so far, it's because I ran out of ammo. Oh, okay, so it's not like tiers where you have to like work your way down. So let's take a quick look at this. What other ammo ones do we got? We got this one. As long as you're at max armor, all armor pickups contribute to blood punch. Demons drop armor at a faster rate. What does that have to do with ammo? Hmm, I don't know. I wish there was more of you guys in chat so I could ask you what you think I should do. Um... I don't know. I guess we'll go with this one. Humans drop armor at a faster rate. Okay, so health, armor, and ammo upgrades are immediately applied along with any unlocked bonus upgrades. Search the environment to locate more sentinel crystals and improve your capabilities. The portal is activated okay. and ready when you are. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Technology. Alright, I'm ready to get my ass kicked again. Let's take a look at the map right off the bat. So... There's a one-up down there. <gasps> there's like a ramp that like launched me over.
Okay, so I can grab onto that thing. Da -da -da -da. Okay, and then... What? Wonder if I can make it up there. No. Okay, well, I guess I go down there. I don't know. I feel like I'm going to die if I go down there. Uh, let's see if there's another place I can jump to. I can jump over there if I can see over that far. Alright, there we go. Yeah, that's actually what happened to me last time. I ended up punching the wall instead of uh, grappling onto it. I went to reload with R, and I used my flamethrower. That's something I'm going to have to get used to. Look at all the work those guys at id Software did. Man. I think uh, Hugo Martin said it took him four years to make this. What the F was that thing? Keep on going to reload. Better. Gotta reload. That's an old first person. Oh, shit. Don't touch me, you freak! <laughs> Dumbass! <laughs> Okay, I feel like there's secrets around here. Aha, what's this? Secret found. My gamer's senses were tingling. Alright. Take this uh, breather to take a quick puff. Hello? Blood Punch! Oh, another move to figure out. Blood Punch is a melee attack that deals extra damage. Glory Killing fills the Blood Punch meter. Once charged, press E or mouse 4 to unleash it. Okay. Blood Punch! Ow. 
right? No? Oh. <laughs> Another thing to add to the finesse belt. Trying to sneak that one past me in software. Mm. Got me? Oh, come on. Can I climb up this? No. Ooh. Runes enhance your abilities or enable new abilities. You have limited rune slots, so choose the runes that fit your playstyle. What? RPG elements. Okay, I'll go through this. Uh, this is probably pretty interesting that you guys are watching. So this one is perform glory kills faster. That might actually be kind of nice. Launch into a glory kill from much further away. You can already launch into glory kills from pretty far away, I think, from what I've experienced. Uh, gain a speed boost after performing a glory kill. Oh, I might do that one. Uh, greatly increased movement control while in the air. Nah. Increases how long enemies remain in stagger state. That would be nice. Survive one death blow and briefly slow down time, giving you a chance to recover. This rune recharges on death. Hold mouse to it in midair to temporarily slow down time. Once the rune is fully drained, you'll need to wait for it to recharge. Enemies killed by equipment or while under the influence of equipment will decrease the recharge time. And enemies killed by a blood punch shockwave. Enemies killed by a blood punch shockwave drop death or drop health. Okay. I think I'm going to do this one. Speed boost. Because I think the demon slayer is slow. <laughs> That fits my playstyle. This is the rune tab of the dossier. Here you can view and equip purchased runes by placing them in available slots. Thank you. I gotta place it in there. Finding more runes will unlock more rune slots. Swap runes to fit your playstyle. Okay. Yeah, so we're good. Escape. Yeah, oh yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Into my trap. Yeah, see, you can do the glory kills from pretty far away already. Okay, I think it's pretty clear.
<laughs> Fail. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so dumb. Two of them? Come on. Oh, I'm stuck! Why are these things kicking the shit out of me so much? Come on! Oh, it's my best friend. Hold that one off. God dang. Clutch. Alright, so complete all the encounters in the mission to earn weapon points. The demonic corruption meter tracks the points you've earned. Each mission has 10 weapon points total. Spend weapon points in the arsenal tab in the dossier to upgrade your weapon mods. Cool. There's a lot of RPG elements in this. I like that. So this is the arsenal tab of the dossier. Here you can upgrade your weapon mods, customize your weapon wheel, and apply custom skins to weapons. Okay. Wow. Uh... So how many points do I have? Six. I've got six, I guess, right there. So movement speed when full automo increased by 20%. Full auto mode transform speed is increased by 50%. Full auto mode recovery speed is increased. I don't re really know what any of those mean. Um So Sticky Bomb Reload Speed is increased by 20%. Sticky Bomb Explosion Rate is increased by 45%. Hmm. Let's get this. And you know what? I haven't even really messed around with uh, Sticker Grenades. Okay, so purchase all upgrades to unlock access to a Weapon Mastery Challenge. This gameplay challenge can be completed to unlock the weapon's full power. 
Learn more about each weapons mastery in the arsenal tab in the dossier. Okay. So I still have three points. Um... Okay, so I can't get anything for this yet because I haven't unlocked the attachments. So... Hmm... Okay, so I don't know what this means, but we're gonna get it. Faster transform. Okay, uh, let's take a look at the map. Uh, looks like we got something over there. Which is the way I'm supposed to go. Yeah, okay. Hmm, I really want that burning note. God. I got it. Okay, I guess uh, you don't want that to touch you. Alright, let's take a quick look here. So that gate's locked over there. What's happening? Hey, how's it going? Another thing! Press left shift to quickly move while traversing or fighting. Dashing into a pit surface instantly attaches you to it. Ah, you can dash twice before it needs to recharge. Ah. Uh... That's not much of a dash. Okay, so... We're gonna... Double jump, dash... Oh. Okay. Spider-Man. So, okay, I didn't think that was going to work. <laughs> Damn, uh, oh, I see it now, I'm stupid. Hello? Man, whoever built this has a lot of money. Wow. 
Wow, that Doom Slayer so pantera it out. So he takes it. You cannot nice. kill the priests. Elder you Scrolls? Our wars. Despite their transgressions against the covenant, they are still of sentinel blood. What you interfere with now is bigger than you can imagine. It is written. It is their time to give penance. If you continue, you will bring down the Heaven's Wrath. You are but one man. They are no longer your people to save. Mr. Doubter over here. Real negative Nate if you ask me. Minding my own business. Oh, oh it's <laughs> electrified. Okay. Well, that messes you up real fast. Dick. Point. Nice. Okay, we came from there. Uh, let's take a look at the map here because I'm OCD. And I missed something. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Okay, looks like I have to go that way. This sentinel battery can be used to provide additional power to your ship. Several modules remain unused. Finding more batteries will enable you to utilize the full functions of your command station. Okay, so I actually, this is where I came from in the beginning, I think. Let's take a look. Oh. Uh, maybe not. I don't know how I can actually get over there. <laughs> Um...
Whatever. Maybe I can't actually get over there yet. Revenant is a heavy aerial demon that specializes in mid-range attacks. Its shoulder cannon are weak points. Destroying them disables its long-range attacks, forcing it to be a uh, melee combatant. Okay. Mark? Always wanted one of those. Does this just teleport me to the other side? It does. Interesting. Um, so about that question mark. Okay, so it looks like... I can get to it from over here. Okay, we'll focus on killing this thing first. Oh. Or something. I don't see it. Oh. Okay, rebuild the celestial locator, obtain the celestial power core, locate the betrayer. Okay. What? Oh, there's like a hole? Maybe I have to get up there from underneath? I don't like not knowing how to get question marks. What is the trick here? Yeah, there's definitely like a underground passage.
the underground passage is like right underneath me right here. So it seems like the entrance oh uh well I found how to get in there but I don't know how to move this thing. Let's check this out. Hmm. So that's where I need to go. But I want to see what's over here. Bet you there's tentacles in here. This looks like Tentacle City. Oh! Can't jump in here. Muck. Auto map acquired. Aha! Okay, micro missiles or precision bolt? High precision, high powered rounds. That would be nice. Or twin rack of missiles. I like precision. Let's do precision. Oh, and they're good for the arachno demon things. <laughs> Yes. Yes. There is a sentinel power core nearby. You can use it to activate the mech and clear a path forward. What? <laughs> All right. I totally zoned that out. I was thinking about something else. So said something about a mech. Oh. Ah. Okay. Touch it. Man. Can I use it on this thing? It bothers me that I don't know how to move this thing. Grenade. Surely that will do it. Oh, okay. Flipping question mark. Ah. Oh. oh. Okay. So I guess that resembles a fist that you can punch. <laughs> oh, I feel so much better now that I can get this question mark. What is it? At Doom's Gate. Album found. Mick Gordon. Oh. Well. Well, that's interesting. Okay. Oh, that's probably faster to go back the way I came. Oh. <laughs> Close one. Gander. Okay. What is this? Oh. 
Invisible wall. Alright, where the there's that. Invisible wall. What the F? I'll have to swing up to over there. jump to next. I don't think I can jump that high. Yeah, I feel so stupid playing this game sometimes. <laughs> Wonder if I can... Oh! No. What do you want from me, game? I don't see any other walls I can grapple onto except for way over there. Oh! <laughs> I can make it! <laughs> that looked like it was super far away. I feel like there's something over here. Maybe not. Oh. Destroy its shoulder cans to disable its rockets. Revenant. Okay, well I'm at half health, let's do this. I'll try out this new, uh, oh, never mind.
dumbass. <laughs> oh, another one now! You hear this bass line? Mick Gordon, goddamn. Sick of you touching me. Come on over. Nice. Well, vast improvement since uh, first started playing. Or maybe it's the uh, abilities that are giving me the extra edge now. Need all the ammo we can get. Okay, I think we can continue. <gasps> Why? <laughs> okay. All right, quick breather. Anybody in chat have any questions? Uh, overall, I'm digging it so far. This is a lot of fun. I haven't gotten to flex my FPS muscles in a long time. Since Rage 2, actually. And unfortunately, I only spent like 40 hours playing Rage 2 because I ran out of stuff to do. <laughs> I gotta break that uh, old habit of reloading. <gasps> okay. The terrain can kill you. Should I go for it? <laughs> Let's see what's over here. Grab a dash refill to completely refill the dash meter. After grabbing one, you can dash again to get across large gaps. What? Um. Lantern. Ouch. Well, I did more damage to myself than the enemies did. Did I just completely miss something over there? Let me look at the map. Purple? What the hell's that mean? Place is a flipping maze. I just got up here. Well, this is the way that you continue, but. I don't know. I kind of want to go over there. So, on the map, it looks like it's this area. Okay, it looks like I have to go around anyway.
Secrets? <laughs> I don't think so. Mech arm! Touch it! Whoa! What the F is that? Laffy Taffy? Alright, moving on. Tentacle City. Yep, Tentacle City. Oh, it snuck up on me. Please! Oh, they're coming out? Coming out of the muck? make that jump or we'll just go this way there's definitely a tentacle in there <laughs> there what Why did I do that? Probably a place for me to jump up. Oh, I probably have to hit it again. Oh. Uh. Puzzles. Can I climb up that? Yeah, I don't know what the point of that box was. Okay. Whatever. We'll just uh, keep moving. Did I come from this way? Yeah, I think so. Hmm. Home hum. Oh, I see. Okay. Kind of blends in a little bit.
Oh, I'm glad that laser was there. Okay. It's a hell of a jump, isn't it? Um, probably won't let me just walk on there, <laughs> I'm guessing. Um, oh, no! I suck! I suck! For some reason, I thought that green thing was an extra jump, not an extra uh, dash. There's gotta be something over here. Guarded by a tentacle. Yeah. Okay. What do we do? Let's see. That was a good one. I, I'm glad that I got that uh, Demon's Drop armor at a faster rate. Flame Belch is actually really nice. That's a very useful thing. I always just waste it because I hit R. Like, I'm going to reload my gun and I uh, waste it. So, cooldown might be nice on that. And these stay on fire longer. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, we'll do this one. I'm all about that ammo. Okay. Ooh. Anything else in the vicinity? Okay, so those crystal things are really nice to get. That's what they look like. I haven't used this detachment yet. Uh, okay. Oh, whoops. I feel like every shot should be a headshot. It's just a big ass brain. Drop straight down. Oh, almost over jumped that. This isn't good. Pick up the health! I'm stuck! Oh, 
Oh, this is so dumb. I don't like being down here. At all. How do I not be down here anymore? Invisible wall. Fine, just get me the hell out of there. That was stupid. Okay, I have to get the crystal. No, okay. So don't fall down there. I'm so glad I got this, uh, I re highly recommend this mod. Oh, it actually <laughs> uses multiple rounds per shot, so... I was gonna say, like, that seems super OP for just, uh, one round. Per shot. Let's not fall into the lava this time. So what did I do wrong last time? Oh yeah, I uh, over jumped that one. Okay. Oh, secrets? Yeah, that's a secret over there. Um, what? God mode? Is that god mode? Can I walk through the lava and not die? Nope. What the hell was it? Hmm. Okay, so let's plan this out a little bit better. So, it looks like the chains kind of lead the path. Because last time I didn't know where I was supposed to go. Okay, it did not lead the way that time. Oh, damn it. Uh, how do you get out of here? What is this thing? Um, oh, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, well that was weird. Um, Jesus Christ. Ha! I don't know where to go. Oh my god. <clears throat> I am not a fan of that at all. At all. It's like I'm being punished just for not knowing where to jump. Get the fuck out of here. I'm starting to get to that point where I just want to rush through this part because I'm getting sick of this.
Yeah, see, I have no idea. You jump over there, and then you get stuck, and then you die in the lava no matter what. So you jump up there, you take a left, and then you're screwed. <laughs> Can't go to the right. Oh, do you just... Oh. Oh, fuck sakes. Slayer gates are optional. Intense encounters, ammo, and extra lives spent in a slayer gate will not be restored af afterwards. Completion awards three weapon points and Empyrean key. Huh. I don't know. Should we try it? Extra speed boost that you get after doing a glory kill could, uh... How do you open this thing? It says punch a slayer gate. multi-level. Oh, maybe that's why I need to punch up there. Uh, I kind of want to try it. I'm going to go back and see what the deal with that is. No? Maybe I just can't do it yet? Okay, whatever. Uh, we'll just keep moving on. And then here I can go up or I can go down. I'm gonna try I'm gonna try going up. Oh. One up. The betrayer's life signal is nearby. Sounds like a pretty nice guy. Okay. Man, there's a lot more puzzles in here than I uh, would have expected. Maybe I have to kind of... How do I get up there? Maybe I have to go back. No, I don't think so. I don't think so. Hmm. Maybe I gotta go over there, huh? Oh, actually... Okay. Okay. There are motion sensors and artillery everywhere. So? Oh, friend? I told you all to leave me here. I am where I belong. No way. Saving your people will not bring you peace. 
Only make the burden you carry worse. And now you seek to defy the calm maker herself. It is your people's time now to give penance, just as it was mine. Hear me, Slayer. When his heart is laid to rest, then his soul will be at peace. And so will mine. See so, yeah, how funny it'd be if, like, Doom Slayer, like, didn't catch it. <laughs> he, like... Because <laughs> he's supposed to be, like, super godly, you know? Makes a stupid mistake like that. A briefcase? Spartan helmet? I want to know what's in that briefcase. Get to the exit portal. Okay, it doesn't say anything's up here on the map, but I'm going to look anyways. Sandworms. Ouch. The extraction point has been identified. I will mark its location on your HUD. That is straight out of Mario. <laughs> What do we got in here? Doesn't really look like much. Just a jumping puzzle. I kinda wanna go over there. They knew that uh, people would screw that up. <laughs> Quick checkpoint right there. Well, it's way better than that last jumping puzzle. Okay. Why would you go over there? The one up was right under. Oh. I guess they were expecting you to jump on it and then wait for it to fall, get the one up and jump off, but I kind of uh, did that a different way. Alright, what am I doing different this time? Haha! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Okay.
No! That jumping thing screwed me! Thing fucked me up real fast. Use the portals. that thing. It's like a damage boost. Get out! Damn! <laughs> That's rough. That is rough. Okay. Let's try this again. Take care of that thing right away. What in the hell's happening? Ah, ha, ha, ha.
А? Слафт. Okay, I died less times than <laughs> the last uh, level, I think. Oh, we can look at this. Nice. thinking about giving me rewards, but it's not gonna. <laughs> Alright, well, you know what? I think that's actually a pretty good uh, place to stop for the night. Um, made some good progress. Uh, my overall impressions of Doom Eternal so far are good. Uh, there's a lot of RPG elements, a lot more than I thought there'd be. Um, the controls are good. Uh, they're actually really good. It's just... I'm not the best representative of it yet. Uh, it's going to take some getting used to, I think. It's going to take some getting used to for for everybody. Um, you know, with all the different uh, controls, like uh, left, alt, control, E, F, R. Um, so, controls are good, though. It's just to get that finesse feel, uh, like when you're really good at a first-person shooter, if you, know what, if you know what I'm talking about, when you're really good at a first-person shooter, you feel this flow. It's almost like this dance where you just kind of go around getting headshots and, you know, uh, glory kills in this case. Um, the maps look really cool, uh, the environment looks really nice, and uh, I'm playing on Ultraviolence, uh, which is not the hardest difficulty. I think there's one or two harder difficulties after this. I am not a new gamer at all, and as you can see, I had some troubles. Um, but I'm sure, like, if I were really comfortable with the controls, it'd be no problem. But I guess that's true with any game you play. <laughs> so, anyway, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I'll be back on again, and we'll continue the story. And um, thank you so much for watching. Godspeed. <laughs>